first i'm going to be taking my freeman deep clearing clay mask and cleanser this one is the manuka honey and tea tree oil one it is so good for acne prone skin honestly i use this mask and my bumps the ones underneath my skin have honestly gone down so much just by adding this to my routine i've been using it for a while and i find that when i don't use it my skin tends to break out a lot more than when i do don't let this dry fully i like to leave it on just for maybe like five to six minutes then I just wash it off and I'm going to go in with my Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula Skin Therapy Oil. And I just pop this on a cotton pad and put it all over my face. This just helps for when I'm ready to shave the little baby hairs, little sideburns and any like face hairs that I have. I like doing this 24 hours before I apply makeup and I'm just showing you a quick little video. I don't do this all the time, it's just when I have my makeup. Then I'm going in with my LA Girls lip scrub and I'm just popping this onto my lips. It helps with dry lips, especially during the winter time. Then I'm going to be going in with my Derma E Myco Dermabrasion Scrub. This helps with under skin bumps and exfoliating the dead skin. And then I'm just taking this Eco Tools face brush and just using it to exfoliate. I'm just washing it off and taking my towel to just wipe Then I'm going to go in with my Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser. This one is for all skin types and it's face and body as well. And I love to use this with a spin brush. This one I just picked up at my local store. I'm going to try to get a Clarisonic soon, so hopefully. I do this for about a minute and then I just wash it off with lukewarm water. And I pat it dry with a makeup towel, like a face towel. It's really soft so it doesn't harm my face. Then because I have a lot more pores and blackheads on my nose, I like to take this Bior for your pores blemish fighting estrogen. And I just pop this on a q-tip and I put this around my eyebrows, my lips, like above my lip, and my nose. Which is where usually when you clean out hairs, it helps to kill off any bacteria. Then I'm going to be going in with my Ola Hendrickson Dark Spot Toner. This is amazing for dark spots and because I have more of an olive type of complexion, especially in the winter, I do tend to get dark spots. It's hereditary, if you're Caribbean, you know. And what I like to do is I like to just pat this a little and keep it there a little longer on the more problem areas of my face. And then I'm going to be going in with my Catrice Energizing Prime and Care Spray. This just has some vitamin C in it, some key and some grapefruit. Then I'm going to be going in with a retinol serum. This one is from my local beauty store. I like to put this on my neck to help with the necklines that I get. Then I'm going to be using something that I've, I've been adding to my skincare routine as of recent and that is the Ordinary Niacinamide and Zinc Serum and I just pop this onto my entire face. First I rub it so that way I can stay away from my eyes a lot more and then I start tapping my face, slapping it. My mom walked in on me doing this one time and she was so confused. Then I'm gonna be going in with my Ola Hendrickson Transform in Invigorating Night Transformation Gel. And I'm just gonna be popping this onto my face really quick. Burt's Bees Complexion Stick. Then I'm going to go in with my Lineage Moisture Night Cream. And I just pop this onto my face. Then I'm going in with my The Ordinary Asliac Acid Suspension 10%. It is a moisturizer that just helps with brightening the skin as well as any breakouts. Then I'm going to be going in with my Acure Night Under Eye Cream. I'm going to go in with a Vaseline, this is just my little mini one. Then I have a bigger one that has vitamin E in it and I just take a mascara wand and I just cover it with Vaseline and I like to put it on my eyebrows and my eyelashes. It just helps to grow my eyelashes and my eyebrows. And yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it and make sure to subscribe and comment down below what videos you want to see and make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you want more skincare routines. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!